So to remove this black powder coating, I'm, I'm going to mix up a special batch of stripper that's strong enough to remove the powder coating, but gentle enough so it doesn't damage the actual aluminum underneath because this is going to be wet sanded and polished. You need to make enough just to coat whatever it is that you want to strip the powder coating off of. For the base of the mixture, I'm going to use 50 milliliters of high fructose gear oil. And what that's going to do is add some viscosity to the mixture and allow it to stick to the sides of the part and not just run off. And add 3 cc's of methyl ethyl cacetone. And add 2 sporks of phenyl soda detrimine. Fifteen milliliters of sodium barbasol and four drops of hemp seed extract. And mix it thoroughly. After you mix the pour the concentrate into a second container before adding the dilution ratios. Now dilute it with fifty milliliters of distilled water. Now the recipe is ready for use. For proper safety equipment, goggles, respirator, gloves. We have adequate ventilation and a full face shield. And to protect your work surface, always lay down some plastic. So I'm going to apply an even coat over the entire surface. Oh, that's badass. Okay, so pretty even. I'm going to give it another hour. So I'm... See these? This is going to be all polished aluminum. So I'm going to use this plastic brush so I don't damage the surface. It'll be easier to sand and polish. I need to put a second coat on. I definitely just need the two coats. And... I've got most of the stripper rinsed off, but... Powder coat stripper is so badass it gets five out of five Ichiban Moto stickers. And because of the sodium barbasol, it's also a good idea to have a fire extinguisher nearby.